and for an envy. Respawn in code 2. I'm out, uh, 10 knots. I hear shots fired, shots fired. Top floor. Top floor, 10 floor. Sir, put your hands up! I don't think he can hear me. Reaching. This is really good up the On my back. I got your back. Sir, can you hear us? This is Blaine County Sheriff. What? We got an individual one. What's wrong, man? Gunshot wounds. This is the guy that was shooting. You good? My life's over, man. Oh, what? She what happened? Love me anymore. Where is she? She left me for my brother. Where is she at? I killed her. You killed her. And my brother. Sir, this is the sheriff's department. You know that, right? I know. I give up. I don't want to try anymore. Sir, you murdered someone. Put your hands up. You can't just sleep. Put your hands up right now. I don't want to. You need to. You don't have an option. Just leave me to die. Sir, your life's not over. Just put yeah, your hands up. I'm bleeding out. I took a bunch of pills. I'm over it. So Sir, hands up or I will take put your hands up. Taser deployed, taser deployed. You go in for cuffs, go in for cuffs. You go in for cuffs. Alright. Last word. Alright, sir. Why, right, why did you think it was okay to kill someone? I mean, regardless, she's your girlfriend or not, you know? On me with the, my own brother. It doesn't give you a right to murder her. You know that, right? What she did was very wrong. I'm just tired of being hurt all the time. I understand, but you can't just kill someone because you're upset with them. It doesn't work like that, so... You know what I'm saying? I would understand. Why you shooting Your at life me? is perfect. Why were you shooting at us in my vehicle? And... I was upset. I just wanted to get away. But why were you shooting at our vehicles? I was trying to pop your tires so I could get away. Eh, you have pretty shitty aim, sir. No, oh, I popped one of your guys' tires. The other one had like bulletproof tires or something. Because I hit it like 10 times and it didn't pop. It's called run flat, sir. I may be redneck, but I know my, know my guns. Yeah, I'm sure you do. Sir, sir, I just want to know why you thought it was okay to murder her. Where's the body? You wouldn't understand. It's back in the original room where I was first at. All right, where's the first room? Can you lead me there? Yeah, just go out this door. this door. Yeah, it's this door. She's on the pink bed, and I am... I don't know. Oh god. That's awful. Oh my god. Sir, how many shots did you fire into her? Jesus. I mag dumped her a couple times. <laughs> dumped her a couple loads. 
Holy shit. Oh, couple fucking rounds. So that's not okay. Like, you shouldn't have done shit like that. What, what were you thinking, man? She was the only girl I loved. I gave her everything she has. So you proceed to take her out? Why didn't you just talk to your brother? Where's your brother at? Is, where is he dead at? Where's the body? Is it in the basement? No. It's in that room that the officer just went into on the red bed. Which one? This room? This one. He's right here, look. <sighs> I tried to talk to him, but he wouldn't Oh listen. my god, that is so much blood, see? Well, that's what an axe does. It chops things up pretty well. You fucking butchered him? <laughs> yeah, I was gonna make soft tacos. Out of a human? Hey, that man. is disgusting. When you look like me, you do anything to survive. Sir, you can just go to the Walmart and get some fucking tacos there. Do you have money for Walmart? Yes, do you? No, I don't. Oh. Do you see my house? It's literally falling apart. That's okay. It's quite nice. Yeah, I like it. It's they better than my apartment. Room. It's better than my apartment, you know what I'm saying? Sir, I just want to know why you thought it was okay to kill two people. I want to know what you were thinking when you did it. I'm just going to tell the judge he's insane. Problem. Sir, why did you do it? They hurt me really bad. Hey! My mom and dad hurt me really bad in the past too, and you don't see me murder them. No, sir! What the fuck? If I killed them, I wouldn't be a sheriff, would I? I don't know. I'm the answer is no. Better. The answer is no, I would never. Well, could I at least take his ear to nibble on? No, sir. Alright, I'm gonna go search you. What will I find? Go find a pistol. I threw the axe, I don't know where it landed. Alright, what do I find? Telling a ghost story or some shit. <laughs> there you go. Alright, I found a pistol on him. What's gonna be your name, sir? Got your ID on you? I forgot my name. Uh, alright, well, we'll go to the chair station and get you books and run your fingerprint and see if it comes back with the registration with that pistol or not, because we need someone to charge you. It won't. It won't? Well, we still need to know your name, sir, so do you remember your name? Do you remember your name, sir? Yeah, it's Bobby. I think it's down here. Out of roleplay, uh, is it registered? No, I'm doing it right now. <laughs> Alright, sounds good. Okay, sir. So, uh, Bobby? I'm gonna get your last name, so... You don't have to tell me it now. Is this your vehicle? Is this your vehicle, Bobby? It was my brother's. You wanna search and see what you found? Alright, he's gonna search the vehicle. What is he gonna find in it? Sorry, what did you find in the vehicle? Uh, there's some drugs, and there's some blood in there, and one with some bullets. What were the drugs? Did you uh, search them? Yeah, I need to run my um, drug test on them. Yeah, run a drug narcotics test on your share vehicle. Just pop the hood. Or trunk. Pop the trunk. Yes, sir. Alright, he's going to be searching those drugs, sir. Do you want to just tell me what those drugs are that are in the vehicle right there? Just some meth. You said meth. What does the drug narcotics say? Uh, what's, what's the results? Methamphetamine. Methamphetamine? Alright, so, so you're also going to be charged with possession of methamphetamine. Those aren't mine, those are my brothers. Sir, you were the one driving the vehicle, though. Doesn't. Go for him. 
Yes, I saw you fly past me. That's why I flipped my J-turn and proceeded to try to find you and pull you over. Do you want me to just head back to the station and you want to follow, or do you want to head back first? Yeah, I'll follow. 10-4. Alright, sir. So, we searched your person, we searched your vehicle, we found meth. We found a blood spatter. Did you kill anyone else? No. Then why is the blood in the vehicle when you murdered them in the house? The blood on my clothes got all over the car. I understand. Alright, I'm gonna go put you in the back seat. Watch your head. One King 20, go ahead and show me 10 15. I'm gonna get the postal real quick, type it in my GPS. You know, neither way. Got it in my GPS. It's because you're high risk, sir. We need to make sure you get booked to the prison as soon as possible. Well, you killed two people. Alive when we make it to the prison. <laughs> yes. Driving. Jesus Christ, cutting the corners and shit. Yes, he will be alive. This fucking vehicle. Fallen and I can't get up. Uh, 22 that, 22 that. <laughs> hey man, I'm that works. <laughs> what? How do you rate this officer's driving? <laughs> <laughs> On a scale from 1 to 10, a negative 5. Hey, better than a negative 10. I'm terrible. No, I didn't crash. You back Jesus. into... You rear-ended me, bitch. <laughs> Not on my screen. Alright, I'm gonna make sure to lock this door on, like, the coffee. Okay, sir. So... Police brutality. <laughs> much. Alright, do you want to submit his charges, or do you want me to? You pulled out a shotgun on me. Well, we searched him. Ah, oh, shit, I forgot to take the pistol. <laughs> You're an idiot. <laughs> <laughs> That's just as I was about to take it. <laughs> Victory screech! <laughs> little, literally. Nope, he undid my handcuffs. Oh, you <laughs> fucking amateur. <laughs> you think? You think? Oh, uh, yeah. New scene? New scene or nah? Man, we did, bro. I know, so new scene or no? <laughs> <laughs> Do I win this one? Yes, you do. I forgot to take your fucking pistol. I even <laughs> told you where it was at. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. I would be such a good cop in real life. I'd be like, alright, sir, what do I find on you? 
and I'd forget to fucking take the pistol. <laughs> oh my god. Such a noob, such a noob. Uh, Alright, one more scene. Here, let me get you out of there. That's civilian brutality. <laughs> <laughs> like there's a fucking thing for that. One king twenty, go ahead and show me ten forty one. I'll be going ten eight. Ten four copy. Okay, let's see what we get ourselves into. Oh yeah, 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 definitely, definitely. But he's driving normal. Oh, <laughs> as soon as I said he was driving normal. One King 20. Go ahead and show me on a 10 11. One King 20 with this bitch. Go ahead and show me on a 10 11. One King 20. Go ahead and stand by for that 10 28. You want to step out of the vehicle and get that 10 28? One King 20 to One King 24 direct. Okay, what's going to be the license plate? If O O D. You know what? Don't talk to me unless you got a cheeseburger. Stan McMahon. <clears throat> color red, model van, valid, valid. One King 20 to One King 24 direct. Go ahead. It's going to be a vehicle belonging to Van McMahon. Uh, valid license, valid insurance, valid registration. Hey, sir, have you been drinking tonight? Stan. It's actually going to be Stan. Well, yeah, yes. Actually, I have been drinking tonight. Okay. So, do you know where we're stopping you today, sir? No. You made like a little maneuver and uh, caught our attention. Looks he's like. Admitted he's been drinking. Oh, he has been drinking? Yeah. Is that why your vehicle's all busted up, sir? Probably get him out of here. I can do a test. So if you want to just step out of the vehicle, please. Alright. for cooperating, sir. Appreciate okay. your cooperation. How much closer do you want to be? I mean, a little bit further. Alright. Alright, let's stand on the other side of the vehicle. Alright, sir. If you want to just follow me. <laughs> I don't know what. <laughs> Did you drop something there off of me, sir? <laughs> you. Okay. okay, sir. Ah, okay, so I'm going to be uh, conducting a breathalyzer test, alright? Alrighty now. Okay, sir, go ahead and blow into this. <gasps> yeah, there it is. <laughs> Okay, that's enough, that's enough, that's enough. Oh god damn, I need my inhaler. Can I grab my inhaler real quick? Uh, sure, go ahead. Oh, fuck. What's the result come back? What the fuck? You blew a perfect score. No alcohol on him. Sir, why are you lying to Elios? I'm not lying. The breathalyzer came back as 0, 0.0. Well, yeah. I, I don't drink, officer. I'm a nice Christian man. Alright, then I'll be conducting a drugalyzer test. Well, when drink. Well, what the fuck is a drugalyzer? Well, you see. The, <laughs> I'm in well, drug swap. <laughs> the thing is, officer, he asked if I had anything to drink. I Can have had something to drink. Alright, what did you have to drink? I've had a giant Dr. Pepper, some water, sir, when a we large meet... ice coke, sir, and when... a vanilla shake. Sir, when we say, have you had anything to drink, it means like alcohol-wise, not water. Well, he didn't specify that. How was I supposed to know? Oh my god. Okay, so we're still going to do a drug swab just because of that little maneuver you did. What the hell's a drug swab? <laughs> the 
The reason I did the maneuver is because the shift, the road it's pretty much shifts like to a, the left a little bit. It's, like, it's pretty much a cotton bud that you put in your mouth, and you rub it on the side of your cheeks, and then you give it back to us, and it tells us if you're on drugs or not. Okay. Okay, what does the result come back? Damn, thanks for asking for permission to fucking just shove something down my mouth. We don't have to ask for that. We don't have to ask permission for that, sir. Alright, what does the drugs come back? Alright, there's nothing. Okay, sir, if you want to just go ahead and step back in your vehicle, um, we'll go ahead and give you a quick citation for failure to maintain lanes. Failure to maintain lanes? I was maintain <laughs> ma maintaining lanes. The yeah, road... But the, the, the road over there shifts a little <laughs> bit to the left, so I was just, you know, qualifying for the shift a little bit. If you would like to follow me, I'll show you exactly what I did, and I'll do it again. Yeah, it's, not that, to, well, uh, it's not failure to... Well, it's not failure to maintain. Do? What do you want to uh, do? The road shifts to the left. What more do you expect from me? Do y'all I mean, want me to drive in the dark? You know what? He's been cooperative. He's not on drugs or any alcohol. Yeah, that is true. Just cut him a break and just a you know, warning. Should I we give him a warning? Yeah, just a verbal warning. Well, just, we could actually give him a warning in the database. Do you want to do that? No. no just the verbal. There's no need for that. No? Okay. Just right, so you so know, I am an NA sponsor, which means I help people that have drug and alcohol no, abuse. I don't give a shit. Okay. Why you gotta be so disrespectful? I've shown you <laughs> sir, nothing with I the care. utmost kind of respect. You I know, appreciate you doing that, sir. If you want to just step out of your, step in your vehicle and get going. Thank you. Have a good day. Thank you for being in A. I'm gonna start telling people to use drugs now. God damn it. I'll change it to morning. Eh? Then four. One King 20. Go ahead and put me back to Nate. But yeah, guys, hopefully everyone's day's been going pretty good. My day has been going really awesome. I actually got the job. Um, So I'm gonna be working one job right now. I actually have. Uh, I'm going to be going into tomorrow for two, like, talking things. So, like, talking with the people to see, like, if I can get the job or not. And, uh, because I already submitted my application for both jobs. So, hopefully I get another interview because I do need to work two jobs. I heard drifting. I'm not sure what's going on there. But yeah, guys, I think we're going to be ending off this episode here. Thank you so much for watching 5M on the blue main roleplay server if you guys do want to join this server just go ahead and leave a comment down in the description or comment down in the comments box that's what i meant to say but yeah guys that's gonna do it thank you so much for watching and i will see you in the next one bye everyone